So let's talk a little bit, just a little bit about this arrest. Um, your experience in prison, how was it like? Because a lawyer, a long you, never thought, you never thought you'd go to jail. Yeah, that was a long time ago. Uh, when you want to talk about the prison experience, it's that incidentally I was kept at the barracks for about two, three months, then sent to whole prisons, where I stayed for about seven more months, and then brought to Oshafort for about a month or two then Afterwards, I was freed. I was happy to be freed, because uh, the experience was, was bad. Hmm. What did you do that got you into jail? Honestly, I did nothing that should have gotten me even arrested. What, I, what happened is that they were looking for Kukubaku and a few friends who they thought were a danger then to, or a rather movement to then the Rolls's government, which had then taken over power from this country. Kukubaku had come to visit me and uh, was going to go to, he said the place was becoming a bit dangerous. Mm -hmm. For him, he's been advised that he should leave town. Some people, insiders, have told him to leave town. And uh, he wanted to go to Abuja by road. So he asked for my permission. I said, Why not? I have a house in Takrade. You can go and live there and continue your journey. That's all he did. And uh, at that time, my, my wife now was in Takrade in my house there. So he received Kukubaku for the night, a couple of days. Uh, not that they were looking for him mm -hmm. officially, but then he really felt threatened. So when he went there, two, three days later, apparently they were looking for him. They came to me. I was living in my residential with my brother Cabra, my cousin, mm -hmm. Cabra Blani here. And, uh, came to arrest me and they were looking for Kukubako. So they took me along. Akatapore led the search group. They gave me severe beatings. Severe beatings, beating, yeah. Uh, fortunately, they saw Kukubako in my house, arrested him. They started shooting in the house when we went. At that time, personally, let me say it, my wife now, mm -hmm. then the girlfriend, were getting closer to marriage then. We had a miscarriage there and then because of the wow. way. Yes. How far was she? I can't tell, maybe about two or three months then. Because of the way they were shooting around. And uh, they carried me quickly back home back to Accra and put us in custody. Just because he was your friend? Just because he was my friend and we, we, he was being kept in my house according to them. So they couldn't leave me. But did they, did they ever people. tell you what Kweku Bako had done? No. At that time... Nothing was said? Nothing was said uh, they needed him. Why was he leaving Accra? Where is he going? But a few other stories came up later. But uh, I'll prefer not to talk right. about those stories.